Adani Group has said that it has secured at least about $3 billion loan from a sovereign wealth fund. According to a Reuters report quoting sources, that is the business empire's latest efforts to try and calm the investors' fears about its credit profile following Hindenburg's scathing report just about a month ago. A memo outlining the highlights of a three-day investor roadshow that concluded on Wednesday suggested that the sovereign wealth fund's credit line could be increased to nearly about $5 billion. But the memo did not reveal the name of the sovereign wealth fund, which has in fact injected about $3 billion. The new fundraising news has come after Adani management held roadshows across Asia to try and calm investor nerves after a market route of a staggering $140 billion in the group stocks ever since Hindenburg came out with its report. The Adani group said that it would repay and also prepay the share back loans worth $690 million to $790 million by the end of March to try and reassure investors. And that has boosted the business empire's listed stocks rally on Wednesday. The shares of the group's flagship firm Adani Enterprises have recovered sharply, gaining almost about 25%, including a 14% rise on Tuesday. The market sentiment has also improved after a group of banks led by the State Bank of India kept the credit limit of Adani Enterprises unchanged. A separate Reuters report has shown the ports to energy empire earlier in the week had dismissed a media report of talks to try and raise money against its Australian assets as totally false and untrue. Now, despite the turnaround, the Hindenburg versus the Adani Group saga has more to run. Hindenburg has said that there is an 85% downside risk to the Adani Group stocks. On an average, the Adani Group stocks are down by a staggering 65%. Ever since, the U.S. research firm that also practices shorting stocks made these allegations of business fraud by the Indian Empire. Whether the business group stocks recovery since Tuesday is a turning point or Hindenburg's call for more downside plays out is yet to be seen. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.